Welcome to Be Smart Medical video, and this is second part of the human heart anatomy, and today we will discuss about internal structure of human heart. Internal structure of heart, the cardiac skeleton is made of dense connective tissue. Inside the heart situated several structure, first is cordy tendinia. The cordy tendinia are tendinous cords found in the right and left ventricles of the heart that connect to the tricuspid valve and the mitral valve in the heart. The function of the cordy tendinia is preventing backflow of blood into the atria and limiting atrioventricular valve's capacity to flap back into the corresponding atrium. Next is papillary muscles. The papillary muscles are located in the ventricles of the heart. They that anchors the cusps of the atrioventricular valves. Each ventricle has an anterior and a posterior papillary muscle. Papillary muscles are five in total number. Now next is the fossa ovalis. The fossa ovalis is an oval depression located in the atrium of the heart. On the lower part of the septum of the wall between right and left atrium. During fetal development in embryonic heart, the foramen ovale allows blood to pass from the right atrium to the left atrium. Next one is the crista terminalis. The crista terminalis is a well-defined fibromuscular ridge formed by the junction of the sinus venosus and primitive right atrium. The crista terminalis is generally a smooth surface. And, the crista terminalis provides the origin for the pectinate muscles. Now next is sinoatrial node or SA node. The SA node is situated in the upper part of the wall of the right atrium. It is natural pacemaker of the heart and, it is made up of a specialized bundle of neurons. It spontaneously generates an electrical impulse. There is another one node known as atrioventricular node or AV node. Atrioventricular node or AV node is the electrical relay station between the atria and the ventricles, it is a part of the electrical conduction system of the heart. Now we will discuss about electrical conduction system of HER. The electrical signal travels through the network of conducting cell. Signals from the sinoatrial node must pass through the atrioventricular node, to the atrioventricular bundle which divides into the left bundle branch and the right bundle branch in which stimulus travels. It is farther divides into the Purkinje fibers that carry the electrical signal. The arterial blood supply of the conducting system of human heart. Mainly the conducting system of heart supply by the right coronary artery but all the arteries of the right bundle branch derived from left coronary arteries. The sinuatrial node was supplied by the right coronary artery more frequently in 70% of cases, than by the left coronary artery and both coronary arteries this node was supplied in 30% of cases. This is quick review of the human heart anatomy. Thank you for watching.